I mean, every city in the world's got their own crew, and they, I'm sure, and they will hold up their own city. So, I mean, I think we're doing our part to show that London's got a decent scene, and you know, we skate every week. We put our hours in, I think. Yeah. Skating in London has helped to, to shape my life um, in that the people who I skate with and, and share, you know, share the art with, um, and in you know <laughs> how it shaped my body for sure. You know, the, the concrete hurts. Psychologically and physically, it shaped me both ways, and uh, both very important parts of my development and growth in life. You know, yet alone in skating, so really important part of my life skating in London. I think we represent the city pretty well. I mean, okay, some a lot of the sessions are pretty bleak. We spend three hours at one spot and do absolutely nothing really. But every now and again, maybe one session a month. We find some new spots or we go to old spots and just do shit that's never been done before. London definitely would have been, definitely gave me the sort of setting where I could sort of discover more creative ways to skate. I think there was one person, actually yourself Matt, who really was pushing creative skating at that time. And you were probably one of the first people that I saw doing tricks that wasn't just to grind on the ledge